got into a little trouble while I was in prison. My first job was a cook in the cafeteria, and then I got a job in the factory. Everything that I did was trying to stay positive and give me some type of uh, advantage when I was released. I was released in February, maybe March uh, 2010. That's when I started with Connections. Being a, a felon with a drug charge, uh, the options were very limited then because of the fact of the drug charge. And uh, a lot of the jobs were not really on the bus line. I mean, there are jobs that, you know, and the ones that are, the buses run like maybe an hour before your shift and they end maybe an hour before your shift ends. So by the time you get off work, there's no bus running until the next morning. Being 57 years old, uh, out there now, I mean, there's a lot of young people with, you know, degrees coming out of college or graduating from high school that's getting the jobs or out there in the running for the jobs. And most of the cases are that if they see a 57, 58 year old man looking for the same job, well, he's not going to be around long. The younger guys is something that they can invest in and maybe they'll stay with the company 25, 30 years. Well, I've got maybe 10, 15. You know, once you go to prison, you lose everything, you know, and then coming back out, you're really coming back out with nothing. And it's hard to build, uh, even look forward for retirement because you have to live for today. You know, you get a job, you have to pay your taxes, you have to find a place to live, uh, either you're renting or, and if you try to start all over, try to buy, well, you know, you can only go so far, you know, and the job that you get, you know, you know, they live from paying them paycheck to paycheck. And it's hard trying to, you know, trying to save up for retirement. I have 34 grandkids, two great grandkids. My goal is to get them all together in one place and just take the pictures and, you know, and they all have pictures of, and I sit in the middle and they all be around me and then each one will have a picture on the back will have everybody's name so they'll know these are your cousins. Uh, you know, we're all grandchildren to Papa Joe. This is our granddaddy and this is who we are. I'm Joe Levels and I'm an alumni of Connections to Success. I appreciate uh, all the help that I've got through Connections to Success. Uh, they really helped me along in my journey. We express myself as being a felon. Uh, how to answer the questions and you know and not elaborate on it but let them know that yes uh, I am I have a felony conviction but that's all behind me and I've done done these positive things to overcome that and I'm looking forward instead of looking backwards.